Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Council post. The layoff epidemic. What employers need to change about their current approach Valentina Drofa, co-founder and CEO of Vintic PR consultancy Drofa Comms. Companies went on a hiring spree from 2020 to 2021, as pandemic lockdowns sparked the mass trend of switching to remote working. The big e-commerce boom and the shifting most of their business processes to the internet has led many companies to expand their teams at a rapid pace, a trend that continued for a while, as these companies expected that the pandemic-induced shift to an online way of life would become a long-term, perhaps even permanent thing, which helped their continued growth. Yet since the second half of 2022, We've seen countless news stories of companies laying off their employees in large numbers from smaller brands to big household names like Amazon, Google, Microsoft and Twitter. Many companies are slimming down to save revenue, and in the face of tough economic conditions, to survive the swing that 2022 has brought. Unfortunately, in doing so they are demonstrating some pretty unethical practices, which I want to address in this article, coming back to that hyper-growth phase during the COVID years, one of the core issues plaguing companies now is that companies often artificially inflate their teams in response to new realities. The pandemic in particular was marked by the rapid acceleration of digital transformation, as consumers went online, and many businesses had to follow suit. This may have caused organizations to have a distorted perception of how many employees they actually need to operate efficiently. And that is okay in and of itself. Plans and circumstances change, and sometimes tough decisions have to be made if companies are to survive. As a CEO, I am familiar with the term myself. The sad thing about this situation, however, is that all too often people get fired from their employers in a casual and different manner. Let us look at the recent news about Google giving 12,000 employees the boot without warning. The news received a lot of media attention as, 